says, This is our Tuesday group meeting. God's Remnant Seeking God at God's Church of Love online. Ephesians chapter 6, verse 10. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against rulers of darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to withstand in the evil day, and having done all to stand, stand. Stand, therefore, having your loins girt about with truth. That means, this Pat's two cents, that means you have to be honest. You have to be truthful. You have to take responsibility. Hmm. <clears throat> Call a spade a spade. That may be more plain. And your feet shod with the preparation of of the gospel of peace. You should be running, pursuing peace at all times. Pursuing peace. Some of you pursue arguments. Some of you pursue confrontation. Now, I'm not just talking to our group at God's Church of Love online. I'm talking to all of you on YouTube worldwide. Some of you pursue arguments. You pursue fights. You get all all revved up when there's getting ready to be a battle going down. Yeah, buddy, I'm getting ready to kick some, you know. Yeah, that's what you like. But that's not of the Holy Spirit. That's either flesh or the enemy or both. Above all, taking the shield of faith wherewith ye shall be able to quench all the fiery darts of the wicked. Which means when people say things, people in, uh, insinuate anything when they're making little snide remarks, sarcasms. You're so full of the Holy Spirit, it just bounces off you like water off of a duck's back. 